about a dozen Secret Service police were inside of this home for hours today, carrying out dozens and dozens of boxes of materials in what police sources confirmed to us is a intricate fraud investigation. And just moments ago, we spoke to the man who lives here. Do you have any comments on why the Secret Service was here? Um, oh, I can't really talk to that, but they were very respectful. They did a great job, so they're doing their job. It has nothing to do with me. Un unfortunately, there was stuff that was in my house, but they're working on it. You can see Secret Service police removing box after box, bag after bag of evidence after a search this morning at a home on the corner of Western Avenue and Geneva Road in Glen Ellen. I woke up and there was a ton of cop cars, um, SWAT team. I had no idea what was going on. Greta Muscatello lives across the street from the home where Secret Service police spent hours sifting through belongings and says she never expected to have a cadre of federal police at one of her neighbors. I was expecting caution tape. I was expecting perhaps an ambulance. I've never seen anything out of him that would indicate a SWAT team or um, anything, you know, serious in nature. In all, about 50 containers were taken from the house, likely filling this U-Haul, driven off by Secret Service police around 1.30 this afternoon. Neighbors saying the family that lives in the home has been here for more than seven years. If you say it's Secret Service, I find that very unusual. Now, uh, Secret Service, of course, uh, do investigate fraud and financial crimes along with uh, protecting dignitaries. However, the man who lives here has not been charged with any crime and has denied any wrongdoing as this investigation continues. Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.